What is your sl- confession? <laughs> no way. I definitely had a five. What? And it was right after I got done uh, with my wife, boyfriend, and it was all black guys. This is ridiculous, man. Ridiculous. What are the chances me and my homies and you have a four? Seven out of ten. What are the chances we do that right now? Right now. Yeah. In the middle of all this. Nah, we got a BNB five minutes away. Okay. Go back to the crib. This one ready right now. Oh, nah. <laughs> this man said we got to go back to the crib. This one ready right now. You obviously have not heard of the Me Too movement, sir. You have not heard of the Me Too movement. In five years, she might change her life and come across this, this video on the internet. Now you in trouble. Okay, now you in trouble. What's the most pettiest thing you've ever done? My neighbor, uh, she a pizza delivery driver. So I call, while she be going, her boyfriend be cheating on her while she at work, right? So I called the pizza spot while she was at work and placed the order so she could come home and catch him in the egg. I was <laughs> hater shit, but you gotta give me some, you gotta give me, you gotta give me a chance to explain why I did So one random day, me and my homeboy Jonathan are outside chilling on the stairs. We sit here watching the neighbors argue. My neighbor and her boyfriend, they just sit in front of us arguing like in the parking lot. They finish arguing, she get in the car, she leave, go to work, and he go back upstairs. I go back inside, I go to sleep. Like, 20 minutes later, bro, I hear, like, smashing coming from upstairs, right? And I'm like, no, like, that can't be his girl, because, like, she just she just dipped out, right? So I'm like, nah, gee, that's probably why they was fighting. That, that makes sense. I'm telling my boy Jonathan, I'm like, yo, Jonathan, like, yo, I think upstairs neighbor, bro, he cheating on his girl, shit like that. And Jonathan, he like, oh, well, that's their business, dad. Like, yeah, like, boy, mind your business. Like, that, that's crazy. Like, he's smashing these girls when they come through while she at work, because that's her spot. But he's right, so I just stay out of it. I'm my own business, ain't got nothing to do with me, whatever. Completely unrelated, um, long story short, I ended up um, catching my manager smashing, right? Um, one of the trainees and they changed my schedule from morning to overnight no, it's unrelated don't even yo he just catching everybody smashing i'm gonna add this before i start the video mind your business if you know somebody fucking if you suspect they fucking go the other way especially at work bro you don't want to be a part of nobody love triangle you don't want to be the outside. You don't want to be the pencil that's drawing the triangle. Mind your business, bro. Stop trying to connect dots. Because when people trying to hide something, they'll do anything. I'm just throwing that out there. They'll do anything. So mind your business. Even Don't think too much into it. If I talk about it, it's going to piss me off. So now I work overnight, so I have to sleep during the day. Why I can't sleep? Because this man got whatever girl he's cheating with, she her moan, bro, sound like a horse. Like it'd be four o'clock in the afternoon, and all here upstairs is. <laughs> <laughs> so, so now I can't sleep. So he messing with me now. Like he messing with me. Like it's 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 personal. So I said, forget that, bro. Next time I hear sex sounds coming from upstairs, I'm, I'm gonna call the pizza joint, and I'm, I'll, I hope it's her to come deliver the pizza. So like two or three times I called the pizza joint, bro, and it comes drop the pizza, and it's not her, right? Report to my call. It is her that bring the pizza to me. And yeah, you bet your ass he's up there with sea biscuit. So she's like, oh, you stay in this complex? Like, I stay here. I stay, I'm your neighbor. I stay right above you. I was like, for real? No. What a coincidence. <laughs> she eat my pizza and she goes straight upstairs. I'm like, oh boy, it's about to get crazy. All I hear is like yelling, streaming, shit breaking, furniture moving upstairs. It's like, oh, they up there bumping. Oh, whoever's up there jumps out the window. Like, I look out the window. I see just a blur go by the window. I'm like, oh my God. I gotta go see who it is. Bro, I'm around outside being nosy, bro. Guess what I see in the bushes? Jonathan. <laughs> Ariana, what are you doing? I said, Jonathan, what you doing out here? He talking about some, I tell you my own business. Why she come home early? I knew it was you. The whole situation was just so crazy. Jonathan don't really mess with me like that no more, bro. Jonathan. Like What's the most pettiest thing you... Wait, his friend? Wait, 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 wait. This story better be fake, bro. Wasn't Jonathan his friend that he was sitting on the stoop with?
Nah, this story better be fake. You know what, though? It could be real. I had an incident. I know I be having stories, but I had an incident. And, you know, my aunt could confirm this. Even though she probably wouldn't get on the, the, the white people's YouTube and confirm it, because she's all religious and stuff like that. But, when I was younger, I had an upstairs neighbor. Right? It was two of them. It was a sister and it was a brother. I used to hear smashing on whoever lived... Whoever's room was above my room, they used to be every day, okay? Like, you wasn't hearing no moans like that, but every single day, it sounded like they was moving furniture or dropping stuff. I don't know what type of sex they was having. You know, when you look at sex in the movies, they just be freaking knocking everything over. I don't... First off, movie sex is fake because when I have sex, we don't knock shit over. You feel what I'm saying? Just knocking remotes over, knocking laptops over, just clearing all the books on the deck. Nobody does that. Nobody does that. But it seemed like my upstairs neighbors used to do that. Let me clarify. You know, I'm young and shit, so I'm thinking, damn, the sister out there just getting fucked. Jesus Christ. But going forward, I did find out. That the brother was, you know, the brother crossed the street. You know what I'm saying? He played for the other team. So, I'm like, oh, all right, that's crazy. So, still, I'm thinking, you know, the sister's getting smashed out, bro. It wasn't until one summer, my house got robbed. Well, it's a long story with that shit, too. But anyway, somebody basically robbed my crib when I came back from college. They took my laptop, my PSP, my Xbox... I had, like, 30 pairs of sneakers. They took all that shit, and they went in my dirty clothes and took, like, my true religions and all my... It, it was some foul-ass stuff. Anyway, I was upset, and, you know, me being young and stupid, I'm thinking, all right, whoever it is, I'm going to see him on the roof. So at that point in time, I used to have a little pistol, so I climbed up the fire escape and... Waited for whoever it is to be on the roof because I figured right, I might catch him hitting down another apartment or whatever. And as I'm walking up there, I realized that the brother's room was actually the room that was on top of mine. You follow me? So that means that all throughout high school, when I used to hear somebody getting ran through up there, is either it was him getting ran through or. It was his his man that he was doing the ran through. Basically, bro, the, the whole my whole high school career, I was listening to uh to two gay dudes having sex. When you say it out loud, it's, it sounds it sounds crazy. I don't know if I should be putting this on the internet. It sounds crazy, bro. But I ain't find out until I went to college and came back and somebody robbed my crib and I finally was walking up that fire escape. I had never walked up that fire escape until niggas robbed my crib. I always thought it was the sister. I thought it was the sister. Crazy thing, I thought it was him and her because I ain't, you know what I'm saying? Like, I don't know, folk. Like, that shit was weird. Because I never seen her bring no nigga up there. And I ain't start see, I ain't never seen him bring nobody up there neither. So I, I don't know. I don't... But it was him, cuz. It was him. I don't know if him and one of the other neighbors has got something going on. But that, it was his room. Yeah, I don't know if I'm putting this on the internet. So this what type of time you on? Are you fucking serious? So this what type of time? Get the fuck out. What type of time? What are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? Bro, it's naked. Bro, it's so in what? This, what bro, the fuck in this bitch are you naked. doing? Bro, it's in this bitch naked. Bro, it's bro, in this bitch what naked. The fuck? Oh. 
how did he get in the back? So, so he crept into the bathroom while they were asleep to press record on his phone. You really, you not that upset if you can do that. But I love it how she got caught cheating and she was the victim. <laughs> Don't y'all love it? What are you doing? Get out. Get out. Mm, get out. That means that it wasn't his crib. That means that it wasn't his house. Young men. Young men. That's all I'm going to say. Young men. <laughs>